Uh, we're here with Jackson Bertoli, uh, junior at Terre Haute South High School. Uh, Jackson finished fourth place at state uh, just two weeks ago. Uh, he was the second best returner for next year behind uh, Zach Panning, who finished second. So he'll be one of the favorites to look for uh, both this track season and next season. Um, so Jackson, first tell me, I know I talked to you after the state meet uh, and you were very happy with your fourth place finish. Uh, is that uh, something you're still happy with? Or do you kind of think about, you know, what if I had done a little bit more? What if I changed my race plan or anything like that? Yeah, I think there's always that doubt, no matter how well you race, you know, could I get, could I have given more in the end? Could I have kicked harder? But um, I, I'm pretty happy with my performance. I think after semi-state, I was kind of thrown off because it was really my first bad race that I considered in my head. But Coach Walsh just sat me down and we worked it out, you know, mentally, just bouncing back. And I think I had a pretty great race in retrospect of uh, how everything happened this season. And so I was pretty happy with it, just placing up there with the team and everything. So. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Saturday night we're here at the pasta dinner at the Terre Haute Children's Museum, which is a great experience. Um, but you got to focus on tomorrow. So why don't you tell us your goal uh, for tomorrow? Is your whole team from Terre Haute South going to be running as well? Uh, yeah, um, we barely made it in the championship race this year, so it's pretty exciting. Uh, last year I was the only guy from our team to do it. So this year it's fun to get the whole team out. It's just it's just fun to run Nike. You know, it's it's not the, all the pressure of the state meet. You can just come out and run all out, no pressure, just because, I, I mean, there's no way we're going to qualify, but it's just fun to run the race. And yeah. just, uh, well, tell me about your goals individually for the race. I mean, is it something where you're going to put everything out there and just, you know, do what you can, or do you have a race plan? I mean, you know, tell me your race plan, obviously, but, uh, you know, what are you looking for tomorrow? Um, I think tomorrow, I'll, I mean, obviously, I would like to qualify for Nike Nationals, but if I don't, it's no big deal. Um, I think these uh, late postseason meets are really just something to have fun with. Like obviously I'm training my hardest and these past two weeks of training have probably have been some of my best in the season. So um, I'm just looking to go out there and do the best that I can do and just hope for the best. So this is your second year doing NXN. You did it last year as a sophomore. Um, so obviously, you know, it's in your backyard. Uh, it's a great thing to have in Terre Haute. Uh, but why don't you tell me a little bit about what you enjoy of the experience of NXN. And like I said, we're here at the pasta dinner, dinner which is uh, you know, a lot of fun. We have all kinds of good runners here, free dinner uh, for all who signed up. It's where you pick up your packets and whatnot. Um, you know, obviously the race is, is cool because there's, it's more glorified than a state meet. Uh, you know, there's always, I love the uh, fireworks at the start and everything like that. So tell me a little bit about the NXN experience compared to you know, maybe uh, some other uh, big meets. Um, it's exciting. I mean, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say really. It's just, it's just a cool experience just being out there. I think last year I was kind of burned out at the end of the season. I got, I think I went like 16.52 or something and just like worst race of the season by far. But I crossed the line. I was like, you know what? It's just a lot of fun just doing the whole experience and everything. All the gear, just seeing all these people, you know, just walking around and be like, oh, I've seen that guy run online and stuff. And I don't know. It's just a cool experience overall. I definitely recommend it to anybody. Uh, but yeah, it's just fun to be here. Yeah, I always kind of say that uh, the first year you do a postseason meet, you know, you're there kind of for the experience. You don't know what to expect. But that second year, when you start to get the feel of what it's like, that's when you can really start competing. Yeah. Uh, so that's kind of where you're at. You'd say. Yeah, definitely. Okay. All right. Well, uh, I appreciate you coming over here yeah, doing no an problem. interview, and uh, we'll see you on the on the course tomorrow. And good luck to you. Yeah, sounds good. All right.